So here we have the Ford Fiesta on a 14 plate. I'm going to start off by showing you around the outside of the car and then we'll hop in and run through some controls on the inside. But from the outside, you can see it's a five door car with alloy wheels. Let's start off inside the boot and then work our way around the rest of the car from there. As we approach the back of the car, you can see we have reversing sensors, plenty of boot space as well, along with that 60-40 split folding rear seat, should you wish to increase this space even further. Okay, so we're just going to work our way back around to the front of the car and then we'll hop in and run through some controls on the inside. But now that we've done a full circle of it, you can see it's in excellent condition the whole way around. Just briefly before we climb in, I think it's well worth seeing the interior from this exterior point of view. There's plenty to run through on the dashboard, so let's hop in and we'll do that now. Okay, now that we're inside the car, we're going to start with the dials. On the left-hand side, we have the rev counter, and on the right-hand side, the speedometer. In the middle, you can see the total miles of the car. They are 26,935. Below that, we have the fuel gauge. You can change that trip computer information by pressing a button on the end of the indicator stalk. Backing out to the steering wheel, we have stereo and phone controls on the left-hand side here. Uh, the phone controls can only be used after you pair the phone up to the car, which is done on the stereo in the centre by hitting the phone button and then following the instructions on screen directly above it. When it comes to music in this car, we've got the radio, of course, and as you can see, we have FM and AM radio available to us. We have a CD player so you can listen to your own music, on top of which we've also got a USB input as well and Bluetooth audio. So once you pair up your phone, you're able to stream your music wirelessly as well as making and receiving phone calls. All of that is done by accessing or by using these buttons just here. We have the main volume for the stereo, deadlock so we can lock the car doors from the outside. We then have the air conditioning for the car. So you can adjust the fan speed, the direction of the air and the temperature. The air conditioning is on at the minute, so off, back on again. You can recirculate the air that's in the car. That's a great way of heating it up or cooling it down quickly depending on the temperature you set over here. We've also got a proper heated front screen to go with a heated rear screen. And then finally, we have a five speed manual gearbox. All that leaves me to say is thank you for taking the time to watch this video. If you'd like to come and see the car in person and have a test drive, please feel free to give us all here at Mac One Cars. We'd love to hear from you soon.